okay yeah and in case you're wondering where have these come from yes they are the ktm mirrors Cause I can fly. I saw them on another motor vlogger uh, on his Himalayan. I mean, his channel name is the Indian Hell Rider. He's also from the same place I am at the moment, which is New Delhi. And I saw them. I saw them uh, KTM mirrors on his Himalayan first. Asked him. And then I went over to Karol Bag and then got these mirrors installed and trust me they're offering me a lot wider view and I can see the, a lot better portion of the road than those stock mirrors. Because uh, on a KTM these mirrors might be an issue because uh, um, I came to know that there are some problems that the KTM owners have reported that they can only see the elbow and. and but trust me on a Himalayan, the handlebar being wider than a KTM so I can see a lot more of the road and uh, this much part of my elbow or my shoulder actually, not even the elbow so yeah, these parts are original KTM parts they costed me 470 bucks plus the labor charges which were 50 bucks so overall a very nice job and uh, anyone owning a Himalayan or if you have any question around this yes you can go ahead and install them not only that uh, the shop person uh, he told me that there are a lot of KTM parts that get installed that can get installed on a Himalayan for example now believe me or not this is what the guy has told me one can actually in install the inverted shock absorbers the front fork the inverted front forks of a KTM Duke 390 on a Himalayan yes it won't be a cheap job or like not a cheap I should say inexpensive it would be pretty expensive uh, but then again one can do that that's what he told you can also install uh, the hand guards which are the KTM hand guards to be honest I did install them but then again they posed a problem which is you cannot lock the handlebar so neither in this or the, in this direction neither of them the handle won't lock so I've kept them off the bike right now okay even though you saw that I have put that uh, handguard on but it was my mistake I didn't notice at the shop that whether the handle will lock properly or not and that's exactly what the problem I have faced now so if you have the hand guards on, the lever guards, these type of lever guards, it will not uh, let you lock the handlebar. So just take a listen from this one. I'll show you what's exactly the, how exactly the bike is now looking like. So this is how the bike is now looking like. I had to open the visor and uh, I have just forcibly just almost pushed it hard. To get, keep the handle locked for the night I will get these things removed or I might have to find a way out maybe a cut through this area I will take it back to the shop because it should have been noted by them in the first place and uh, yeah so that's it don't put these uh, guards on at the moment till the time I figure out something I will talk to the shop 